Evening, lords and ladies. I am Night Before Dawn, and welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Today, I would like to talk about triangular windows. Um, I didn't have any time to do too much this weekend. I have my daughters visiting, so I figured I'd do something for you guys. I don't want to leave you hanging, but we're a little too busy to do much. Anyways, as you can see here, I have a foundation pre-laid out that is off and it has two grids in it one is offset by 50 percent nothing too exciting there if you've been watching my channel you should know how to do that by now and on the corners of the offset grid I am placing half logs and then on the corners of the inline grid I'm placing full logs I don't know if I said blocks or logs for the first time but I meant logs and once you have to place the full logs in before you can place these across here and that's very important because you need that for the next part on top I'm just going to fill this in along here to get just to get to the halfway point come on give me the snap there it is and I don't want to go any farther than that right now because it gets in the way but you can just fill in the bottom half um, and that's if you want the windows at this height. You could use uh, quarter logs and three quarter logs for lower windows or there's quite a few different options for um, various heights as long as you have them at half a log height difference. So now I need a, another half log and what I'm going to do is I'm going to come and I'm going to place the half log so that the arrow here seems to be coming out of the log that's coming up and as you can see it's placed centered and I'll do the same on this side then I take a one quarter log place them on top of that doing the exact same thing now I don't need the flashlight and then I'll take my full logs again and just snap on the inside um, I suggest you snap this first sometimes you can snap it after, other times you can't, so I suggest snapping it into place first. And then you can, I've always been able to put the ramps down after that, so there we have it. The window is made and the rest of it is just a simple fill in the remainder, because you come over here and sometimes it's awkward because it wants to fill in that slope, but you just keep looking and you'll find the right spot. There, oh, there it is, and perfect. Now you have a full wall that is simply, or ah, you have a full wall that has a simple triangle in it, and you know it's unique. So you can have there's various shapes you can do. Um, I'm trying to work on an upside down triangle. Um, it may have to be a lot bigger than this, but I may also do some force snapping to allow for shorter upside down triangles, but we'll have to see what I can come up with. Anyways, if you found this useful, I would greatly appreciate a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much.